Uh, I had uh, two very quick ones, if I may, one for John and one for Kim. Um, you know, the first one for, for John really, uh, there's been a lot of questions about user engagement as we enter 21, right? Uh, there's two big trends that could potentially impact user engagement, particularly in the mobile side of things. Uh, one, obviously being COVID, which you talked about in detail, and then two, the launch of the, the new consoles. So my question really is on the latter. Have you seen a slowdown in engagement across your platform as a result of the, the new console launches? Or are the supply issues acting as a small benefit today since a lot of people haven't gotten their hands on one? And then really the second one uh, for Kim, uh, can you break out you know, what percentage of your total revenues are advertising revenues? And then perhaps if you, if you do that, uh, what are the margins associated with those? Thanks. So the answer to that somewhat lengthy first question is no. Uh, you, might want, um, you might want some color on that. So um, just a starting point, when we, we do monthly engagement, um, on um, it's mostly mobile because most of the world's players are mobile. And let me just give you some way to think about that. In aggregate, adding all the consoles together in any given month, you might have 100 million players. Now, they're obviously very engaged players and they spend a lot of money. A lot of them spend $60 for titles, upcoming 70, um, you know, $70 uh, dollars per title. Some of my videos on it. Um, and so those are very important customers. But engagement is over 2.7 billion users, most of them mobile. So I, I would say that, you know, the console launches has relatively little effect. Um, what typically happens and is happening now is those that were able to get an Xbox and a PlayStation, the new generation products in, in the end of last year, is they shifted themselves from prior consoles to the new consoles. There, you, there's definitely always a, a big kick up in engagement for those users that managed to get the new hardware. But if you look at the numbers and the scheme of things, um, you know, we're talking about something that was already three and 4% of the total user base. And then of those, a tiny portion of them managed to get an upgrade to the new hardware. Um, what I expect to happen, and I think this is important, is that um, the, the market for console and PC has been losing market share at the hands of um, mobile for quite a while now in, in dramatic ways. And typically around, um, you know, around a new uh, console launch, new hardware, there's a reinvigoration of console and I fully expect that to happen. Um, I'm looking forward to playing more of the console games on the new devices. But no, we haven't seen any sort of net reduction in engagement. Yes, in terms of uh, the advertising revenue, so we don't break out our revenue by product. We have a mix of product and services, products and services within both create and operate. I can say that it is the largest piece of our operate solutions business, because primarily because it was the first. Um, we've been building that business for several years now, and some of the other products and services within operate are just relatively newer. Um, so certainly, you know, so, so it is it is a larger portion of that business, but we're not breaking it out. Um, on the question around margins, that's also something we're not disclosing. We, we actually as a company don't really look at our margins by you know business line. We look at the total company margin and then we do look at product by product margin profiles. And we're not breaking that out, but I can say that when we look across all of our products and services, two of the highest gross margin products are our subscription product and our monetization service. I want to add one last nuance on the um, engagement point. People buying higher end phones definitely correlates to increased engagement in mobile gaming. And most people install more applications around um, new hardware. You know, you get, you, you, you've all done it. You get a new phone, you install a bunch of new stuff. Um, the numbers on uh, the new Samsung, you know, and the new Apple phones are numbers that are orders of magnitude bigger than consoles launches are in terms of um, user households. So don't forget that what we've just witnessed is not just in the world of console, it's also in the world of mobile. 